Hello everybody. Um, so what we're going to do today is I'm going to show you um, one of the, uh, sorry you're looking at the keyboard, I'm just trying to hide it from you. Um, we're going to, ooh, what's that stuff on the screen? Oh, I don't know what that, I don't know what that was. Um, so, Briar released another special run for Briar Fest this year. As you can see, it's not this one. We've done seen Jubilee already. Um, I say um a lot. Sorry if that bothers you. They, they just released it today. I, for some odd reason, just decided to look up and see if they would have anything else on there and then I've seen this guy and I know that there's not any other videos of him on right now um so we'll go ahead and get a look at him just to kind of keep you waiting more he is on the Carrick mold one of the premier club horses I believe it was he's on that mold and I know a lot of people actually don't like that mold because of the biomechanics of it um, somebody actually like measured him out and all of his legs are not the same size like it's four different sizes so they're not too happy with him so I don't know if they'll be happy about this one I don't know um the coloring on him it looks pretty good but I mean again I don't know everybody's cup of tea is not everybody else's if that just made any sense so I won't hold on. I'll hold out on you guys any longer. Uh, here he is. Um, here, let's see if we can. There we go. Uh, this is what is your name? Bonafette. Bon. Yeah, so it's something like that. It sounds French. Ooh. Uh, so he is a bay. Blanket, extended blanket Appaloosa on the Carrick mold, like I said. He has, this isn't going to focus very well, but he has Motlin on his lips. Uh, it looks like he has a star, a little extended star, and his, he has pretty markings on his hooves and his legs. So, um... I mean, you can just see the overspray in the promo picture. Sorry, that was my arm. Um, which, it might not be overspray. It might just be part of the markings. But they look really terrible if it is. I don't... Here, we'll just go back really fast. I'll show you the, uh, the picture of his other side and then we'll go... I don't like the mold. It's not just the fact that um, the biome can't like would like I mentioned before. Like all the legs are weird. It's not even that fact. He, I just, it, I just don't understand him. I don't know. Like it just looks really weird. So they've released three special runs so far. I think I've done a review. Yeah, I've done a review on all of them. Jubilee was the last one released. And then this guy, he was with... He was, like, jumbled up in a video with all the other horses that they'd announced so far. So, this... I want to kind of go a really quick over them again. Because this is already four minutes long. And I don't mean to talk as much as I always do. It just happens. Um, so... This is Champagne Toast. It was the first special run released. I don't care for the mold too much. It's on Audios. And I don't care for the coloring either. And something I especially don't like is the leg barring. I really, it just looks like they've just like smushed it on there. I don't know. But out of all three horses I'm not happy about any of them which is good because my wallet can rest easy so far this year but watch these last models they release 
be like the best. I'm still waiting on, of course we won't see the shovel, but, or the, uh, the shovel, the, uh, the surprise horses, and we have also not seen the animal yet. So, one of them is going to be the animal, and then one of them is just going to be like the surprise models. Um, this is Jubilee. It's on the Andalusian Stallion Mold. He is a silver bay. Uh, let's, is there not big pictures? There's not big, why is there not big pictures of him? There's big pictures of everybody else. Let's see if we can find some big pictures. Jeez. I don't know if there's big pictures. No, there's not any big pictures of him. Well, they must not want us to see something. Okay, well, anywho, I don't, I love silver bays, but I don't like it on this mold, as I said in his last review, and you can go look that up on my page. Um, I'm just not happy with him, but, and that's my opinion, so I mean, don't be like, oh, he's beautiful, whatever. I mean, go buy him. Uh, satisfy yourself with buying him. I just don't like him. Uh, and then this Bonafetch, the new one on the Carrick. I don't like him either. <laughs> I think it's a little bit of a combination of everything. Uh, I don't like how extended his blanket coloring is. The pattern, I don't like how extended it is. I don't like the mold itself. And I would definitely not want to pay $75 or so for each of these horses that no matter how limited the run is I just wouldn't want to pay it I mean the you people on here that uh, still use your parents money for everything go ahead go ahead and buy to your little hearts desire but when you get older and you have to start like working for the models that you want like I do now you have to pick and choose which ones you want and these ones it's not none of these are worth my money right now uh... so i think i'm going to end this video here with a bit of a tender spot touched <laughs> i guess you could say uh... so i think that's it i think that's all i want to talk about uh... leave your leave a comment below do you like whatever his name is bonafette I, I, I don't know what to call him. Uh, shoo. I don't know. I just don't know what to say. <laughs> He's so ugly. Like I said, leave a comment. Like I tried to say before I interrupted myself. I don't understand. Uh, leave a comment saying if you like him or not. Uh, leave a comment on any of my videos saying if you like any of the models released yet. I know a lot of people aren't too happy, but a lot of people are as well, so it just kind of depends. Uh, I'll talk to you guys later. Happy Briar Festival!